Mayor of Townsville, Liz Terrell, and to the Federal Government for Herbert Dewey Jones for giving up their time to be here today to open this expo. There are a couple of other significant people with us today that I'd like to ask to say just a few words. And the first is, is the President of the Townsville Chamber of Commerce, John Carey. And I'd then like John to hand over to Donny Harris, the Chair of the North Queensland Small Business and Development Centre. Would you please welcome President of Townsville Chamber of Commerce, John Carey. Welcome everyone uh, to the first of what we hope to be many North Queensland Small Business and Franchise Expos. Uh, I acknowledge you and Jones, a member of the Herbert, Les, the Mayor of Council, and Johnny, the Chair of the North Queensland Small Business Development Centre. Seventy percent of our 500 and something, 570 something members uh, are small businesses and franchisees. Uh, the Chamber, along with Organisations like the Queensland Small Business Development Centre are important advocates for small business and also provide important networking opportunities for small businesses. As Les said, if, if you have an idea, the uh, Small Business Development Centre is able to help you nurture it. Once you've nurtured it and you want to sell it to others and you want to network with like-minded individuals and organisations, you can come to the Chamber. So we are important advocates and networking opportunities for small business owners. And you can find us at a booth near the front door where you can pick up a membership form, let us know the issues affecting your businesses because we want to know about those and we also play an important lobbying function the government and other bodies to assist our small businesses in their endeavours. So finally, I'd like to congratulate Donnie and the team and Brian uh, at, at the Development Centre on what is going to be the next couple of days for you. Thanks very much. <laughs> he told me not to forget to introduce Tony Harris, the chairman of the North Queensland Small Business Development Centre. Uh, thank you, John. Uh, I'd like to say, uh, well, I'd like to start by firstly acknowledging the previous speaker's performance for the following reasons. Uh, firstly, I'll start with Les. When I always do these uh, speeches, I always acknowledge the support that Les has given to the organisation in terms of small business development centre. Les was uh, instrumental in starting in 1996 and has since then taken, taken a strong role in, in, in ensuring that it, it maintained and, and strived towards the original objects for what it was set up for. So I think, Les, thank you very much for your foresight. Um, Ewan? In recent times, has been a strong advocate for the projects that we undertake, and uh, we certainly hope to continue that that support because it is, without doubt, uh, very important to our ongoing success, particularly with respect to uh, delivering the small business advisory services that we do. Mm -hmm. And John, uh, the chamber, as you've already mentioned, there are some similar objectives that we do have, and it is important that wherever possible, the two organisations work together. And I'm delighted to see. That the Chamber has got on board with this uh, expo and is supporting it in the way it is. On behalf of the North Queensland Small Business Development Centre, I'd like to say thank you to all uh, for your support and sponsorship and for being here. Like any event, its success depends on that support, and I think uh, we have done a great job in, uh, I guess, getting all of that support together and ending up with a great outcome, which is the event that we have here today. Can I say that our hope is that it does become a biannual event. Um, we want to see it as part of the regular business and event calendar. And certainly, um, given what I've seen here this morning, I don't see why that won't happen. Um, it's certainly something that is needed here in the school business community. Can I also say thank you to uh, the Board of Directors of the North Queensland School Business Development South and to our staff and Brian Arnold. Uh, you have been instrumental in pulling this together. Had the vision uh, and the foresight to make it part of, I guess, our strategic plan to uh, put together an expo which helps us deliver our objective of really creating opportunities for small business and creative. I also have a few other thank yous to, uh, to say, uh, particularly to our main sponsors. So, can I uh, please thank Glenn Parkle, Susan Daniel, and the team at Census Yellow Pages? It is the Yellow Pages North Queensland Small Business and Franchise Expo. They are 
uh, a major sponsor and supporter. Thank you very much. <coughs> Bryce Nielsen, Matt Chapman, Peter Mays, the team of Sky Radio. Thank you for your support as well. Roberta Jais Rear, I've got it wrong. I apologise, but um, that's that's my pronunciation. And the team at uh, Channel Seven. Thank you again for your support. Kirsten Gadsby and the team at Fisheries and Zoom Business Magazine. Well done on delivering a, an excellent uh, expo guide. It's a uh, very professional outcome. Thank you very much. But thanks also again to the town and city council uh, for supporting us um, as always, but also in particular the body of the Thank you very much. And uh, can I just say uh, enjoy the expo. And of course, uh, when you do leave today, go home and tell your friends family to uh, come here either for something or something. Thank you very much. Thank you, Donnie. Ladies and gentlemen, could we uh, just show a round of applause for all, all of our, uh, our officials here today who, who opened the, the expo. <laughs> there will be a, a slight break, a short break, just on our keynote speaker. I don't get too far. Uh, it should be about five or ten minutes, and then we'll be coming back into this room. It's a white taser. So, probably five to ten minutes, we'll see you back here again. Thank you very much. <laughs>